All right, back to Commitment 2016 coverage, and we continue our eight issues and eight week series with how health care is factoring into the presidential campaigns. Now, this is the third year that people can enroll for insurance through the Affordable Care Act. But as WMUR's Nicole Killian explains from Washington, it's not the only health care issue that's important to voters. Throw the law out. It's all got to go. It's an issue that has polarized politicians and voters alike. We are done. Yeah. Ever since the president signed his landmark health care law nearly six years ago, Strike it down. Strike it down. it's caused controversy from the courts to Congress. This was not the health care that was promised to Americans. Health care should be a right guaranteed to all. After dozens of attempts, Republicans resurrected legislation to repeal the law they dub Obamacare. The bill as amended is passed. While lawmakers also chipped away at portions of it in a massive budget bill and may use it as a talking point in 2016. From a political perspective, Obamacare has been the gift that keeps on giving for Republicans. Whenever they've run on it um, aggressively, they tend to do, do fairly well. Putting Democrats on defense. You can't go in and tell 12 million people who have insurance because of Obamacare, we're taking that away. You can't tell people, say with cancer, who have gotten insurance because of Obamacare, that they no longer have insurance. So while the presidential hopefuls may play up the issue on the trail. Obamacare has cooled a little bit. Um, as an issue. Kaiser Family Foundation CEO Drew Altman says polling shows the public has more pressing health concerns. We found that the high cost of drugs, this was really a surprise to me, uh, emerged as the number one issue for people as their top priority for the president uh, and the Congress. In fact, Kaiser says the majority of those surveyed are concerned about the prices of so-called super drugs for chronic illnesses, as well as rising out-of-pocket costs, especially when it comes to deductibles. In Washington, I'm Nicole Killian reporting. And, of course, the public remains very divided over the health care law. According to a Kaiser poll, 40 percent of people favor it, while 46 percent are opposed. Even greater numbers here in New Hampshire in opposition. You can read more about the top issues, though, for the 2016 election on WMUR.com by clicking on eight issues, eight weeks in the politics tab.